Hello everyone, my name is Kasim. Welcome to the channel. If you're new to the channel, you are welcome. If you're not new to the channel, you are welcome back. So in today's video, we are going to talk about Tesla. I'm going to show you guys my Tesla stock. Basically, every, every week or week and a half or so, I share with you what my Tesla holdings are doing and you know how the perform uh, how the portfolio is uh, performing because tesla is one of the my one of my number one conviction stock like my all-time number one conviction stock at the moment so i always like to share with you guys exactly how the stock is going uh, how the stock is going so i i started doing doing uh, a, a segment like this uh, last year or something like that i'll leave the first video in the cards for you to check out and i basically i i'm going with the premise of i just want to invest 20 dollars every day into the company because i don't have a huge amount of money to dump in you know if i had like hundreds of thousands of dollars i probably pull like a quarter of a million dollars in there and i and i don't ever have to work again for the rest of my life that's what i think anyways <laughs> But anyways, so I decided to just put $20 every day into Tesla stock. But before we get into it, let's get the disclaimers out of the way. So before we get into, into today's stock, I, I just always like to do this in all my videos for legal purposes. You know, I am not an investment advisor. I'm not an investment professional. You know, guys, I'm not allowed to lie to you guys. Nobody's allowed to lie to you guys on the internet. If they do, then they can be sued and all these things. So we have to put in these disclaimers that I am not an investment advisor and I'm not giving you investments. All I'm doing on the channel is just sharing with you what I'm doing with my finances, just opening some windows into my finances so you can see how someone just like you is investing and trying to grow their wealth. So with the disclaimer out of the way, let's get right into the video. But like I said, before we get into it, I just want to point out to you guys that what I'm doing here is just I'm trying to invest $20 a day into Tesla stock. You know, I invest $20. It's like $100 um, per, per week. It's like $400 a month. That's like my bare minimum that I invest into Tesla. There's sometimes that I will have extra money and I'll dump it in when the stock drops a lot. And sometimes when the stock drop, I don't have the extra money. I just put in 20 bucks a day. And the reason why I'm doing the 20 bucks a day is because like I believe the majority of people in America, in the world, well, in developed world anyways, I think most people can afford to put $20 into one of their biggest conviction stock. If there's a stock that, you know, you, you have 100% conviction on and you know that this stock is going somewhere, you know, like, for me, I know that Tesla is going places, you know, I've done a, a lot of videos explaining my reason why, and I'm going to keep on doing it until people get it, um, that this company is transitioning the world into sustainable energy. You know, Tesla is going from a company that is making 500,000 cars last year to making 1 million this year to maybe the next 10 years, they're going to be making 20 million cars, okay? Okay. And in another 10 years time, the, their stock price today will, will, will seem really cheap, you know, in another 10 years time. So I just want to come on the channel and share my, my reasoning and my journey and my, not just only share my reasoning, my thesis, I want to also show you how my investments are going uh, based on my thesis. So I form, I think about what's going to happen in terms of um, investments, different companies, I form a thesis around that, and then I invest based on my based on my, my my thesis, my reasoning, my logic. And with Tesla, I believe that next year they are going to smash their delivery numbers like we've never seen before. Every year from now, they're going to keep on breaking new records. You know, so the big headline news um, that happened recently, let me share this with you guys. The big, the big news that happened recently was Tesla, Tesla Motors, this, that's their website is coming from, from, officially from their website. Basically, they smashed the numbers. Like 
when you're talking about smash something like they they absolutely knock the numbers they, they, the, the the from january till till march like they smash these numbers these numbers are amazing so they're saying that they they um look at that in, in the first quarter we produced just over 180 thousand vehicles and in the past three months what happened in the past three months you know like there's a huge cheap short shortage we're dealing with coronavirus we're doing with there's so many things that we're dealing with but yet tesla is still able to drop this kind of numbers like that is quite amazing that is amazing for them to be able to drop these numbers that means people want these cars people they, they are selling these cars and this is just cars they're selling these cars like hotcakes. People want them, you know. They can't even make enough of these cars, you know. So they delivered. They delivered. Um, they they produced one hundred and let let's, let me show you guys right here. So they produced one hundred and eighty thousand vehicles, and they delivered nearly one hundred and one hundred and eighty five. You know that is that is amazing. That is that is great. You know that means. This 100, almost, this is almost 200,000 cars. And mind you, mind you, for production, for the production side, they did not even make any, they didn't make any Model S or Model, Model X, right? They didn't make any of those, those. They just delivered the previous ones that they had, had from the last quarter or whatever. They delivered those ones from uh last quarter of last year they delivered those ones so now um in the past three months in the past three months from january till now they produced 180 80,000 and they were able to deliver a total of like they said like they said here 185 184 800 to be exact and they even they even tell us here let me let, where's the section here Da, 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 da. Let's talk about financial performance when we when we when we announce Q1. Okay, so this so this the same. We're gonna see the rest of the numbers in Q1. The section that I wanted to share with you guys. Let me. So our delivery count should be viewed as slightly conservative, which most of the time, most of the time with Tesla when it comes to their numbers, they're relatively conservative. Like they don't tell you things that they can't necessarily accomplish now the time that they accomplish it might be different in the, you know they might not accomplish it on time like the time that they said they're going to but the thing is they are going to accomplish whatever they say they're gonna they're gonna accomplish so which is a good thing you know you want to see that in your companies the companies that you're investing in you want to see that they are you know saying they're gonna do stuff and they're actually doing it if we fast forward this time if we look forward if we look forward to you know march 20 2022 i mean if we, next year when we get these numbers it's probably gonna be like two hundred and fifty thousand. you know because they have a factory going they have their factory that they're working on in texas they have the factory that they're working on in Germany and the, the factory that they're working on in China as well. That one is still expanding. And at the same time, they are working on the $25,000 car. They already, they already kind of working on it. It's not official yet. It's still a rumor, but they are already kind of working on the, the factory that they're going to produce the $25,000 car in, in China already. Um, you know, like, next year the numbers are gonna be mind-boggling you know it's gonna be nuts so yeah like this this is the kind of thing that i like to see with um the companies that i, I invest in like these numbers are absolutely amazing you know not only that their numbers not only that their numbers are amazing like they're also trying to do a good thing like you know they're trying to invest they're trying to make the world a little bit more greener so we don't mess up the earth <laughs> you know i think that's a great thing but anyway so let's get back to the let's get back to the stock 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 here because that's why you guys are here you want to see the performance you want to see the performance of the 
of the twenty dollars per day that I've been doing, you want to see the performance. So let's get let's get right into it. So this is what we're looking at. This is what we're looking at. So if we look at all times, we are up one hundred and seventy two on this investment on Tesla. And if we look at um, today, today, the portfolio is is up three hundred dollars and is up four percent. So let's look at the week. Let's look at the week We're up a thousand for the week, 12 percent, almost 13 percent. So for the month, past 30 days, we're up 14, 1400. And <clears throat> the past three months, we are down for the past three months. Now, unfortunately, when we saw this drop, I think I only bought one of the dip. I bought one of the dip. I didn't buy this one, which I'm going to show you guys in a bit. I didn't buy this second one here. Let me move this out of the way so you can see. So I didn't buy this second one. I didn't buy this one. I didn't buy this one. I think I bought this one, but I didn't buy this dip. So which is, it was sad for me. I didn't have the cash to be able to put, put that extra in. But anyways, we up in a total of um, 30, 30, 3,500, 3,500. And the portfolio is up 170%. You know, the performance is great on this portfolio. It's, it's done fantastic. It's done well. You know, this is probably one of the best performing um, stock that I currently own right now. So I currently have like 12.73 12 point, 12 point, um, shares uh, at an average cost of $394. So... Hopefully they split it again in the future. If they split the stock again in the future, it will be amazing. You know, it will be absolutely amazing. So let me go back and show the transaction section and show you guys how the transaction is. Um, so you can see how I've been buying on a regular basis. So we're going to look at the transactions. We're going to look at how I've been buying on a regular basis. Um, so you can see the dates and see the you, basically you just see all the buys. Because what I do on this channel is transparency. You know, I, I'm transparent with my portfolio here just because I believe that like there's not enough um, investments out there in terms of uh, people sharing their portfolio, um, showing how just your everyday folks can get into investing. You know, like if you watch if you're watching someone's um content on youtube or something like that and you're seeing a hundred grand you might be discouraged and be like hey look i don't have a hundred grand so he's lucky and you know i'm just showing you something different you know like with this portfolio here it's just it's just different you know e everybody can can invest to get to invest something like this you can guys see 20 bucks 40 bucks 20 for the most part i've been putting in my 20 bucks on a regular basis let's see here let's continue you guys see as far back as possible let me see going to january <clears throat> uh, i think this is where i put a little bit a little bit more put a little bit more here but well, i've been putting in my 20 bucks every single day into the stock like i've like i've said i'm going to you know so yeah, let's. Uh, I hope you've um, you've enjoyed looking at that, and you've seen you've seen that this portfolio here, this portfolio here, it's basically anybody can do this. You know, anybody can do this. All I've been doing is just putting in twenty bucks every day, and I'm sharing it with you guys. Uh, that's because the reason why I'm able to comf comfortably buy Tesla at any price. The reason why I'm so com comfortable in buying the stock at any price is that I am knee deep with the company. Like I'm subscribed to Elon on Twitter. I'm subscribed to the, the, the Tesla community, both the bull and the bear side. I'm subscribed to all of them. And, you know, like I read up on the news. Um, I do like 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 this numbers that just came out. You know, a lot of people probably are not looking at this numbers. Well, I am, <laughs> I am because, you know, like I'm investing a lot of money in the company. So 
I want to make sure that my money is working well and, you know, it's getting the company is getting the job done like I expect them to, you know. So I look at the numbers. I, I keep up with their product. I keep up with their earnings. I, I'm basically an, an um, I'm, I'm constantly researching more and more and more and more into the company. So by doing that, you know, by doing that, that gives you. Um, that gives you a peace of mind when the markets don't believe in what you believe in, because sometimes the market don't believe in what you believe in. The stock can be going down like crazy and it provides a buying opportunity for people like me that research a company and know about the company, you know? So that is how I, um, operate this investment. I think this investment will one day be worth millions of dollars. I don't know how long it will take me. But it will be it will be worth millions of dollars one day, definitely for sure. So what else am I doing? I'm gonna share with you guys my price prediction in terms of Tesla stock. Okay, let me pull up the chart. So let's let's take a look at the chart a little bit here. Let's just kind of hack this down. So I was working on this earlier on, and I I, uh, I wanted to share this with you guys. This was the recent dip that we had that we had here. It was a pretty it was a pretty big it was a pretty big big drop. It was a pretty big drop. But I was still buying my $20 every day and when I had a few extra cash, I put it in on the days that I had that huge drop. But this was a pretty big big drop. Now with Tesla coming up, with Tesla coming up with the numbers that it just came up with, I I think that their stock could potentially like shoot up even more. So looking at the chart here, you can see that they're basically on the, on a on an uptrend. Uh if you look at the MACD, MACD has fully crossed over and it looks like we are we are we are this is the bullish side of of the chart here. So this could the, the stock could potentially see a, a nice push push up. Now if the stock breaks this price and this was the price that we're looking at is if it breaks at seven what's the price right now six six ninety one yeah if it breaks that seven hundred dollars seven ten this top this top 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 on uh, trend line right here once it breaks it because it's breaking the previous high right once it breaks it this thing is gonna sh gonna going to run you know it's gonna run and i'm gonna have this video here this video is gonna be here when I do my future updates to show you guys, you know, this chart looks like it's going to run. So I'm going to put it, I'm going to put a little bit more money once, once Tesla, once the stock goes above, once it goes above this night, 700 mark, I'll probably throw in another like three to $400 extra just because we could see another bull run here because Wall Street knows, Wall Street knows what's up now because now tesla is delivering numbers you know tesla is delivering numbers they know what's up now if you look at here look this with this is without the the luxury segment because model s and model y that's their lux, lux, well luxury segment because it's expensive to get those cars so this is without that and um you know they they were able to deliver almost two hundred thousand cars without their lux without their luxury cars. You know, so they're only del delivering their their, their um, medium price cars, which is the Model Three and Model Y. So, you know, they average from basically thirty five, thirty eight thousand and above. So they obviously they're gonna sell more of that. Um, but there's some people that they. They, they don't want this. They will probably buy Model S or Model Y, which is hundreds of thousands of dollars. So this number is, this is their Q1 starting January till March. This number is great. This is great numbers for um from Tesla. Absolutely amazing numbers. So the other thing I also like to do before I, before I wrap up is I would just like to skim through the news section um, whenever I check on Tesla. Just see what's going on, you know, because obviously uh, Wall Street, they don't like Tesla. They don't like Elon. So they're always throwing out some FUD, some 
not so true news about Tesla. So surge seven percent. That's well deserved because of the numbers. Tesla. Oh, people are predicting that the stock will get to a thousand. Record record high model model three and model Y deliveries. I mean they did well this quarter. My Tesla stocks jump sharp sharply. How long will Tesla dominate EV? For as long as possible, Tesla will dominate EV sales for as long as possible. Because all the other other automakers, all the other automakers out there, like it, it will be very hard for them because you're talking night and day. It's a huge difference, you know. Your experience during the daytime is different from your experience at nighttime. Okay, it's night and day. You know, these the the old like news like this. News like this is always always so fu- funny to me when I see headlines like this. That's, that's why sometimes I don't even bother with with reading anything about Tesla from from wall street because it's just it's just very stupid how long would they dominate for for as long as possible because these people basically they create this in ev industry like they started it you get what i'm saying like they started this thing so it would be very difficult for any of this um automaker to come and say they want to do it because it's like creating it's like ford trying to get into making iPhones. You know, it's going to be hard. I'm, I'm not saying they, they can't do it, but it's going to be hard because you can, now you're going from need, needing mechanics to needing needing software engineers to to needing, um, you know, software engineers, different type of engineers. Um, and Tesla has the best engineers. And fortunately, Tesla has the best engineer. SpaceX has the best engineer. So Elon being the boss of both companies, I'm sure both companies work together, you know, which would benefit Tesla. Like, people should not slip on the opportunity that Tesla has to provide. Tesla investment, especially especially the retail community. If you're watching this video, you should consider doing your own research. Look more into some of the things that I'm saying. Check out some of my other Tesla videos. Check out the playlist. Watch those videos, you know. While you're at it, don't forget to give this video a like, you know, <laughs> give this video a like and subscribe to the channel, you know, because this company is going to, let me turn this around. This company is going to change things for a lot of people. They really are, you know, because like I've said in my previous videos, if you were around to invest when Ford first started making cars, you be your generation will be a multi-millionaire right now and this is a thing that we're seeing with this is what we're seeing with tesla in my opinion you know investing in tesla for the next couple of years could mean you know the in um you know generational wealth can, can start can be generated you know that's my belief you know because the car industry l- let me leave you guys with this and now and now and now and now and now go The car industry in the world is 90 million cars per year. That brand new cars that get sold every year. 90 million. And this is part of a new wave that is going on right now. Out of that 90 million, Tesla just delivered 184 in the first three months of 2021. Now, this is a pin, right? This is a pin drop is not a big deal but we have a couple of factories that is coming up you know the product line is expanding you know like guys all i have to say is guys don't slip on this not investment advice but don't slip on this investment opportunity anyways guys thank you very much for watching again if you haven't subscribed to the channel subscribe to the channel because my channel is relatively new and i'm trying to grow it so i need your help to grow it by subscribing and giving my video a like check out some of the contents that uh, i make on this channel the goal of this channel is to get my portfolio up to a million dollars in net worth 
And, you know, when we get to a million dollars in net worth, we have the Tesla tequila right here that we're going to celebrate with. You know, still have a long way to go, but the tequila is waiting. So help by hitting that like button and subscribing. So, yeah, thanks again. I appreciate you for watching. Until next time, see you later and love you all as always. Thank you. Take care. Bye. No place I'd rather be